And last of all, we've got some cycle sort of modes here. So let's have a look at these. I'm just gonna take those off and the frame buffer. Control Alt and A will snap that to the end. And we can just copy and paste those keyframes there like that. So these guys here, if we select the curves, we've got pre-infinity cycle, pre-infinity cycle with offset, post-infinity cycle, and post-infinity cycle with offset. So just the pre-infinity, that will make it infinity cycle that way. And this guy here, the second one, the third one, will make it do the other side. So that's how we can switch on the cycling nice and easily. Now, the difference between some of these modes is if we zoom in here, we can see that cycling nicely. Whereas if we bring this up, you can sort of see it's trying to re recycle that curve exactly each time along the curve, along the, the graph editor. But if we come in here and we use this guy here, which is pre-infinity cycle with offset, that will then have that going down on an angle, sort of connecting those dots, so to speak, as they go like that. This one here will do the same in reverse, post-infinity cycle with offset. You can sort of see that. So these sort of cycle offsets are good for walk cycles and things like that, where the character actually isn't walking on the spot and has to sort of move forward each time. You can use uh, cycle offsets there. Now, when it comes to cycling, a lot of those things are found up here with the pre-infinity and post-infinity cycle. So there's a few different modes that you can do. Have a check through some of those, the cycle and cycle with offset the most common but we've also got oscillate linear constant etc etc so let's have a look just quickly by selecting this curve and go post infinity so linear is probably one of the good ones and you can grab that there now that's post so let's get the pre-infinity and make that one linear as well and you can see it there that's just if you want plane to fly and just keep flying in a direction you could use those ones. We've also got some other ones like oscillate and constant which constant is just the default oscillate will go backwards and forwards you can sort of see that how it's sort of a mirror image of itself there doing different things so oscillate will just go backwards and forwards as well so there's all the offset types there infinity if you don't want to see it we can just go view infinity that's where infinity belongs there so if you don't want to see that dotted line to see what's happening that's just a view thing there and if you want to turn them off of course post to constant and pre to constant, constant, and uh, that'll switch that off and just be back into regular mode. Of course, you gotta do that for the whole object. And now we're just back to defaults there.